What's going on guys? Back at it again with another Fallout 76 video. So in the last video, we ended up coming over here to the crater, meeting the raiders, and setting up this whole situation where we have to get them inoculated, and we got them to agree. And quick note too, just a little bit uh, to preface a little bit more, the prior video to last video, we did the same exact thing only to the settlers over at Foundation. So at this point, we have it set up to where we need to go back to uh, the Overseer and see if we can actually work on the inoculation project for everybody instead of just for us. So that's what we're going to be doing in this video. If you're excited for this video, do me a huge favor, drop a like on this video. Also, subscribe to the channel if you're not already subscribed, because it really does help this channel grow. So, with that being said, let's go ahead and get going. Alright, so, we are here at Crater. Should we just fast travel? I think we're just going to fast travel. Um, actually, that is definitely what we're going to do, because we're super far from the Overseer's place. Where is the Overseer's place? Um, Overseer's home. Well, that's, damn, that's going to be expensive. Maybe we, yeah, fuck it, why not? I don't even care right now. This is probably the best bet for us anyways. So if you hear a little rattling and stuff like that, um, don't mind me. I do have a you know a cup of water with ice and stuff. It is starting to get warm. And I do live in Arizona, so even the nights are pretty warm. Uh, so I do have to keep myself hydrated while I'm you know, doing everything in here. Because like I said, it's Arizona. It gets pretty freaking hot out here. So yeah, there's that. <clears throat> Plus, you know, it, it's always good to have some water on the side to drink when you're doing something like this Because when you're <laughs> when you're pretty much uh, do what I do and talk non-stop A.K.A. exactly what I do um, It gets pretty, you know, rough on your throat, man And uh, that's probably why you guys hear me going, like, clearing my throat and stuff like that uh, Pretty often it just it it's pretty strenuous on my uh, on my vocal cords and stuff, so it's always good to have a little glass of water just to you know keep myself hydrated, and my throat soothed a little bit too, you know. So there's a a little uh, education, uh, and I think this is like the four hundred and four hundred and one video that I've made. I know it doesn't it it's crazy that I've made so many videos, but it's true I've made that many videos. Wait, is this the Overseer? This isn't the Overseer's house. Damn it! I jumped down for no reason. Well, good thing this guy has marsupial. Might as well take advantage of the fact that he has uh, mutations. Because I might... I don't know if I'm going to, but I might be taking that away from him. <clears throat> Just mutations in general. I might take away mutations just so I can use those perk points on something else but I'm not entirely sure uh, we'll we'll cross that bridge when we get there but we're here with the overseer so let's go ahead and talk to her hey overseer any luck with the newcomers yet as a matter of they fact convinced to accept our help absolutely um they've agreed we just need the inoculation good I knew I could count on you I've been looking into where we can mass produce the inoculation some of the obvious choices are messy. But if you just sit back and ask yourself, who could have manufactured a lot of specially formulated liquid in sterile packaging, it becomes obvious. Wall Street. <laughs> a consumer-grade food or beverage company like Wall Street, a.k.a. Nuka-Cola. Exactly. Great minds, huh? Sure. The local plant even has all the equipment to make experimental <clears throat> beverages. Perfect for us hacking in the inoculation. The current occupants were giving me some trouble, though. I could use your help on this one. Meet you there? Sure, why not? So, we should probably just fast travel there, man. The Nuka-Cola bottling plant is way down here. Man, this mission... This quest is literally going to uh, <clears throat> dry up my freaking caps. It's a lot of fast traveling with this one. But hey, you know what? It's all good in the neighborhood because we ended up, um, you know, get, getting the whole quest line started for both the settlers and the raiders. I've already said who I'm siding with. Uh, my main character sided with the settlers. 
Uh, because he's kind of like a goody two shoes, I'm not gonna lie. So this guy, I don't like. Pl I'm not gonna lie to you, dude. I just don't feel comfortable playing like an asshole or a dick. It's just, I may, I may talk a lot of shit and stuff like that, but I do it in fun, in, like out of fun in games. It's really not me, you know what I mean? Who the hell is this guy? If the scorched or the ferals don't get you, the rads will. If you need some ammunition, I can help. Oh, okay. Uh. <clears throat> Let me see, uh... Oh, uh, I mean, I've been running low. I'll take it. There you go. Just don't let it go to waste. I wonder what he gave me. Shotgun shells? Eh, not my forte, but it's all good. I'm not gonna fault him for giving me free stuff, you know what I mean? Alright. This place is usually... Fix that. Ugh, it never seems to end. I wonder where... All these people are coming from. Because this place is usually infested with scorched. Or feral ghouls like these guys. Hello. <coughs> Damn it, and I missed. <sighs> Sit your ass down. Sit your ass down. I guess we're going up against uh, ferals in this one. Look at that. This, uh, this guy is a military man. <laughs> what are you doing? Get away from me. Oh, snap. Is this a bad guy? No. All right, good. All right. Well, let's go inside. Watch it not even be in here. That's a pretty cool picture of me in front of Foundation. I actually used that as a thumbnail. Oh, the Overseer's here. Hello, Overseer. This is it. We need to get the power up and running and reformulate the machines for the inoculation. Fire everything up. And try not to get killed. Yes, ma'am. Is she gonna follow me? Oh, she is. Nice. I can hear the freaking ferals everywhere, though. Luckily for me. Oh. I'm not about to let anything stop us. Good. No, come back over here. I'm not scared of you. Oh, uh, this guy wants me. No, come over here. Haha, <laughs> oh man, he didn't he actually didn't die. Chopped them off into little pieces though. Um Alright, so I guess we gotta come come this way. Nuka-Cola scientists were trying chemical substitutions to make new flavors. Why is she aiming That's at me? That's how we're gonna trick it into making the inoculation. We just need to figure out how to mix soda ingredients to produce human antibodies. Easy, right? Duh. Um, so enter the biometric scanner. Is that because I'm already inoculated? <laughs> I'm just gonna guess yes. That's added your blood sample as an ingredient. I guess that technically makes you Nuka Cola's newest flavor. Ooh. Actually, maybe don't think about that too much. <laughs> it's so gross. All right, looks like we got something else over here. Um, Nuka Cola, uh, Nuka Cola, Nuka Cola flavor sequencer. Reminds me of the equipment back at the Vault Tech Ag Center. Let me know if you want me to take over. All right, we'll see. Uh, a complex set of laboratory equipment is right in front of you. So the options is intelligence plus eight, uh, splice antibodies into the floor formula, uh, perception plus eight, use exp the experiment logs. Or ask the overseer. I think I'm gonna go with intelligence because I like to be a little smarty pants. That's it. Now we just need to restart the reactor, then we can manufacture the formula. Okay. So what I did is uh, you carefully isolate the antibodies in your blood sample and then use a simple recom sure splicing technique to turn uh, the yeast ingredients into little vaccine factors. Stories. You think it'll it will taste citrusy? Ew, that's disgusting. Ew, let's listen to this real quick. Our latest market survey reports that healthy on-the-go snacking is up eight percent across all market sectors, and is expected to propel demand across the next several fiscal years. Our first experiments are going to look at reviving celery flavored <laughs> margaritas. It's a beverage that has its origins in the 
and has a built-in recognition with demographics that crave outsider status. We think we can balance artificial flavors, package design, and marketing to convince people it has healthy benefits. We're working with legal to figure out the limits of what we can claim, but right now we're leaning towards classic digestive beverage for the new generation, and or a green tonic water from America's greatest era. Oh, okay. Well, let me take care of all of these little guys real quick. Because they are feisty little buggers, aren't they? So I have to go that way? Or... Okay, yeah, I gotta go this way. There's a lot of them. Holy shit, where did all they come from? Here. No, come here. Come here. Sit your ass down. Man, those things are disgusting, dude. Alright, let's uh, take a rad away and get some of these rads off, dude. Luckily, I have healing factors, so I get my health right back. Jump starting them, but the reactors are completely shot. Die! Ooh. Regenerating. Well, let me see something real quick. Nah, it's only a one star plus. It's only level 30. I think I'm good. Hold on. Am I here? I think I am here, actually. Wait, how do I do this? Oh, it's this thing right here. Uh, reactors. Examine. <clears throat> a complex set of reactors are wired together to provide power to the factory. They aren't working. So my options are leave, replace the power couplings, uh, intelligence plus eight, uh, engineer a workaround, luck plus eight, jam random things together. <laughs> I'm going to go with the, uh, engineer a workaround. Good job. That'll be enough power to get the larger equipment up and running. All right, so the couplings are damaged, but only due to a thick layer of oxidation over the conduct. Uh, co fuck me. Well, you guys, I didn't get to read it, so uh, I hope you guys read it or paused it. I'm going to have to read it later because I'm not going to be able to see it until it's all done. Since I got attacked, yay me. So, initiate manufacturing process. I guess we have to go back to where we were, where we did the uh, blood sample. I'm assuming. Kind of feels like it's in that direction. Um, here, let's climb up this way. Overseer, you're going to have to hurry up. Um, I think that's actually the case. Wait a minute. I hear one, but I'm not sure where it is. All right, we're actually here. <clears throat> um, overseer, I hope you have my back, cause uh, I don't like the looks of this. Get out of my way. Can I do this, please? All right, let me see. Uh, manufacture new product. Abs a freaking lootly. Uh, let me see. New flavor sequence detected before manufacturing can begin. The marketing department protocols insist that a full branding analysis be performed. Based on the flavor profile of unknown human antibodies, uh, mixed with sugar and carbon dioxide, who would you say the target audience is for this beverage? Young people 13 to 18, uh, older professionals on the go, uh, 25 to 35, people who don't want to, si to get sick and die? That's weird how this is even an option. Um, I mean, I guess I'll just be truthful. I'll do this. People who don't want to get sick and die. Based on your choices, we predict the most appropriate color uh, will be air color selector. Use default values. White with red letters. Uh, with this color scheme in mind, what should the name of the beverage be? Nuka Cola vaccinated. Nuka Cola scorched. Nuka Cola, my blood's in it. <laughs> so stupid. Um, I like the name of scorched. This seems very medicine-y. And this just seems trolly. Oh, fuck. Um, it's between these two. Let me see. Eeny, meeny, miny, mo, catch a tiger by its toe. If he hollers, let him go. Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. Oh, I guess we're going with scorched. Well, that was. 
<laughs> I'm sorry. I, I just can't help but wonder what it was like to actually work here. Oh, I thought she was going to say something. Can you believe this? I thought she was going to say something about the choice of the name. Your input has been uh, processed and your beverage is ready for manufacturing. Please start the assembly line manually to begin. Uh, labeling input already set. Uh, please return to main menu for options. All right. Uh, marketing protocols. Uh, executive level clearance required. Please contact corporate for permissions. No, thank you. Backlog. Uh, whale shark. Uh, status. On hold pending legal investigation requires corporate authorization. All right. Orca. Uh, status requires. Requires upgrade equipment to handle corrosive nature during processing. Uh, product on hold pending equipment arrival. Purchase 930-2077. See facilities for details. Uh, Albatros. I don't even know what that means. Um, status. Placing and blocking per Dr. Hayward's request. Requires additional research into chemical reactions with gastric acid. That sounds gross, actually. All right. So we're done. So now we gotta um, go downstairs and start the manufacturing process. All right. This is it. It is it. Luckily for me. No shit. It's not like you're gonna do anything, overseer. All right. Start the assembly line. Is it gonna come out through here? Oh, yeah, it is. Nuka-Cola score. It actually says Nuka-Cola Scorched. I want to take a picture of that. Oh, I love that picture. Hold on. Uh, Does this not have a... Uh... This one doesn't have zoom. No, Monica. It's all good. That picture was pretty decent, actually. Um... So pick up the new. Oh, I'm supposed to pick it up. That's it. Freedom from the plague in a bottle. While you're handing those out, I'll start organizing things here and get a plan in place to get more to whomever needs them. Meet me back in Sutton when you're done. Uh, will do. So now we gotta deliver them. It looks like. So let's go up here first and give it to Meg. Fuck, man. All right, there we go. 50 caps. My God, I'm going to be broke by the end of this freaking mission. But it's all good. Uh, we'll give it to Meg first, and then after that, we'll go down to um, Foundation. And then give it to, uh, what's his name, Paige, over at Foundation, of course. <laughs> this mission, or this quest line, if you will, it's actually pretty interesting. In my opinion, I actually really like the 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 whole story in uh, Wastelanders. All right, let's go. If you say so, ma'am. Hiya. Pretty sure Molly got me drunk. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> I kind of want to um at some point explore all the NPCs in Crater. We kind of did it over at Foundation. We haven't done it for the crater yet. We just kind of came here for the story, and that's about it. Hey, Meg. Hope you're here with the delivery, 7-6. Patience ain't exactly my strong suit. You know, if you're going to talk shit, I'm just not going to give you anything. But it's time to talk caps. Convince me we need this inoculation, then dangle it over my head for your cut? <laughs> I dig your style, 7-6. Good. Yeah. This ought to soothe your mercenary heart. Um. Uh. Yeah, sure. Fuck it. Here you go. Wait, 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 wait. Bottles of nuka? You trying to scam me, seven six? Drink the damn soda. <laughs> uh, technically, it's an oral inoculation. Whose distribution vector is a carbonated beverage? Clearly. And you can spare me the details? Wouldn't want you to hurt that brain of yours trying to use all the fancy words. I'll no make sure it gets distributed. 
Looks like you're off the hook, 76. See you around. Good. So. So is that it? That doesn't surprise me as much as Um, all right, let's go down to the Brotherhood Foundation. Even the damn free states. I don't even know what the hell they're talking about down there. Probably that everything got destroyed. I don't know. It is what it is. They're all dead. That's all that matters to me. I guess. <laughs> God, man, I don't know why. But that video with this th that had this thumbnail, it was a 4th of July uh, video that I made last year. It's super short. It's not, I don't even think it's 10 minutes long. But it's, uh, it's really, really short, man. But it's probably one of the most fun I did filming a video. Um, I wish I could remember what it was actually called, man. But it's, it, it's, it, uh, it's like freedom... Freedom something. I can't even remember, to be honest. It used to be one of my um, most popular videos on my channel. But, unfortunately, it got taken out by all kinds of videos, man. Which, I mean, it's not a bad thing. It's a good thing, actually, in my opinion. Because that just shows that people actually like some of the other content that I, you know, make on this channel. And it's pretty, pretty cool, actually. All right, but let's go ahead and go talk to Mr. Page. Page. Oh, Page. I'm coming for you, buddy. All right. We got to go up here. John, anyway? I just don't get it. I don't even know what that is, so I can't help you there, buddy. All right. Um. Yeah, well, man, I wish I could remember the name of that. That mission. I don't know. Let's go. Um. Hello. So got that vaccine yet? Uh, here you go. What's this? Nuka Cola. Nice looking label, I guess. What gives? Um, hey, medicine doesn't need to taste bad, uh, right? Drink up. Well, I guess I should be impressed if you went to all the trouble of making it easy to take. Absolutely. Still don't know what to think of you, Vault Dweller. But, well, saving us from your plague is a good start. You watch out for you and yours out there. Oh, you know what? I actually remember the name of the video. It's called Exploring Freedom. It's, uh, I believe part three of this entire Fallout 76 series, so it should... If you guys want to watch it, you guys can definitely watch it at any point. It, uh, once again, it's called Exploring Freedom. But let's go ahead and go fast travel back to the Overseer. And... Finally get this whole inoculation project done, skis. I think we're saving Appalachia. One faction at a time. It's a beautiful, beautiful thing, isn't it? <clears throat> that vi that picture is so blurry, man. That I had to take that picture for um. Or that's not blurry. It's foggy, but. I have to take that picture for the um, one of the tadpole quests that sent me all across Appalachia, basically, to take pictures of certain things. I did like the picture, just why I kept it, but the I, well, I should say I was like I like the fact that that was a photo opportunity location, but the quality of that photo wasn't very good. But I kind of had to do it because um, it it was just a part of the quest, you know what I mean? So I I, I did it. Or whatever. Alright, let's stand in front of her this time. So that she can actually look at us. Hey, Overseer. The inoculations. They're on their way? Yeah, it's done. They're inoculated. <sighs> what a relief, huh? We'll get shipments up and running in case that first batch wasn't enough. Look, I know you're doing more than your fair share of the work. Don't think I didn't notice. 
Thank you. Good. You're welcome. Now that one crisis is over, it's time we start working on that mystery in the mountains. Oh, absolutely. Have you heard the latest? Um. <laughs> oh God, story time. Count me out. All right. Um. No, I've been uh, out of the loop. A few other people from 76 made the trek into the mountains to find this treasure we keep hearing about. It's a vault. Vault 79. Sealed tight with no obvious way in. The rumor mill about what's inside is running wild. We don't have a way in, but I think I have a plan to at least find out what's inside. Every student who graduates vault Tech University has a story about the restricted wing where all the higher-ups would have their meetings and not just stuffy professors and their mr handy assistants i mean sit downs with government officials the military um let me see uh so we get inside see if uh if they were meeting about this vault? Over 25 years in the making for me. But it's time to finally see what it's hiding. Meet you there? Absolutely. Let's see what we get out of this. Um, Probably nothing special, to be honest. Uh, stim packs, 44, and recipe. Do we even at least at bare minimum get... Uh, Okay, good. I was about to say a legendary item. We did. So, wait, 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 wait. Uh, Overseer Unseen. Enter vault -Tac University. All right, well, let's go ahead and level up. Uh, we'll pick a perk card. And I need to get Commando. Um, <clears throat> Commando. Yeah, let's go ahead and get Commando. We'll max this one. Out. Actually, you know what? Let's get one of each for now. Uh, that way, at some point, it'll be a little easier. Yeah, fuck it. Let's just get it. Alright, cool. Oh, man. I got so much cleaning up to do. Because a lot of endurance has to go into perception. Uh, well, realistically, probably the things that I'm going to move over first is the... The strength ones. Uh, because I'm not going to need Barbarian. I'm not going to need Slugger. I'm not going to need Martial Artist, uh, Slugger, or Master Slugger, obviously. Um, I'm not going to need a lot of these Endurance ones either. Suppressor? Why didn't I end up getting... Hmm. I need Tank Killer too. Yeah, I don't have tank killer. Man, I, there's a lot of perk cards. This is going to take a while to do. Uh, uh, yep. Well, it's going to take a while. So, don't expect to have a fully completed, um, you know, commando build anytime soon. Because it's clearly going to take a long time. But unfortunately, that's going to do it for this video. In the next video, we're definitely going to go over to vault -Tac University and see what we could do about going over there and uh, finding out some secrets that vault -Tac had. Go figure, vault -Tac having some secrets, right? But if you enjoyed this video, do me a huge favor. Drop a like on this video. Also, subscribe to the channel if you're not already subscribed because it really does help this channel grow. So with that being said, catch you guys in the next one. Deuces.